I'm Rigoberta Menchu. I was born in 1959, uh, January 9th to be precise. I was born in a poor, small family in Chimel, Uzmatan. I lived a humble, campesino life like any other indigenous woman. But I wasn't really happy since there was a lot of poverty and discrimination going on at the time. During my young adulthood, there was an armed internal conflict in Guatemala. My father was involved. He was one of the protesters. He was tired of all the injustice and discrimination that we were suffering. And one time, he went to the Embajada de España to protest. Shortly after the protests had started, the police interfered. They burned the place to the ground. Almost everyone inside was burned to death, including my father. My father was not the only one who suffered because of this. My mom, she was tortured and murdered by paramilitary groups. I decided I had to change this. I decided that no one had to live the things that I went through. I created a pacifist movement against the regime of Guatemala and against the violation of human rights. I called it Teología de la Liberación. So I decided to walk the streets. I told my story, hoping that someone would hear it. And sure enough, people heard it. They seemed interested <laughs> and they seemed eager to help. They joined. My voice was heard. But unfortunately, sometimes by the wrong people. I was persecuted by the government and went to Mexico for my own safety. There, I continue to travel the world and spread my message. Luckily, the UN heard me, and they decided to give a helping hand. In 1988, I returned to Guatemala. Now with protection, and continue to battle the injustice. In 1992, I was blessed with the Premio Nobel de la Paz. With this great honor, I was able to help even more the conflicted situation in the country. Then I decided that I had to, uh, my message had to reach people's hearts even more. So I decided to write my autobiography. And that really moved people. Now, now I am the ambassador of the UNESCO Goodwill Company, and I am currently running for president of Guatemala. I just hope that my mom and dad were here to see this. I hope that I have accomplished some good things, 
and that I have helped the situation. Thank you.